Hey guys, what's up? What is going on today? As you can tell by the title of this video, I am doing a about me tag because I want you guys to learn a little bit more about me. I'm not sure why I didn't do this in the beginning, but hey, it's okay. I'm still learning this YouTube thing. Still learning and Google. Still learning and growing. So let's go ahead and get started. Before we get started, I want to thank all of my new subscribers. I've noticed that I got a few new subscribers and I'm super excited. You understand? I, I texted my husband and I was like, babe, I have 41 subscribers now. That's crazy. I, I'm super geeked when I just get one, two, three, and just having 41 subscribers. I think it's 41 right now. It's so awesome. And I'm super excited and thankful for you guys. Thank you so much for enjoying and watching my videos. So let's go ahead and get started. I think I said that already. Question number one, what is my full name? My name is DeAndrea Jones. And number two, my zodiac sign is Cancer. I really don't believe in that, but my zodiac sign is Cancer. Three things I love. Three things I love is, uh, I love sweets. I really like sweets. And I have to cut back on it because my tooth is starting to hurt. Ooh. But yeah, sweets. I love candy. Um. Oh, I love singing. I love sweets. And I uh, hmm. love music. Okay. <laughs> what are four torn four turn on? Four turn ons. Um, and I'm not thinking about a sexual turn on. These are, these are not sexual turn on. These are just really great things that makes my heart just jump and pop. So, yeah, gonna make that clear. But I love to see people who, who are passionate about stuff. Um, I love I love to see fathers who are stepping up and doing their duty as a father. Um, Oh, I love um, another thing that makes my heart just jump. It's just somebody who is authentic in their worship before God. Someone who's not putting on a performance or a show, but someone who's like, God, here I am, use me. And it's just so beautiful. It's so beautiful. Okay, one more. One more, one more, one more, one more, one more. I can't think of one right now, so we're gonna stick with those three. Okay, it says what are four turn-offs? Again, it's not sexual turn-off, these are just things that just cringe me. Okay, one number one is I hate, I don't, I don't, I don't want to say hate. That's very strong. I do not like when I see people bullying other people. I don't like bullying. Because majority of the time people are bullying because they don't like their, they have some insecurities and to make them feel good, they try to make somebody else feel insecure. And I don't like that. Number two, Number two, number two. Um, what actually came to my mind, I don't like to see when a parent is not allowing their child to see the other parent because of the issue that, that they're having. Don't bring in the child into your issues. Okay. Number three, I'm gonna think of four, but I can only think of two right now. Okay, we're gonna go with that. We're gonna go with those, those two. Um, how many tattoos or piercings I have? I have no tattoos. I'm too scared to get a tattoo. Uh, I have two piercings. I want to get a second hole, a second hole. Uh, I want to get my second hole pierced, but I'm too scared. I'm too nervous. So my thing, I think, I think what I'm gonna do. Um, whenever my baby girl, um, whenever I take her to get get her ears pierced, I'm gonna get mine, get mine's pierced too, because I want to experience what she's going through, um, so I can know what I need to give her, not give her, blah 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 blah. Yeah, one of one of these days. See, how do I feel right now? How do I feel right now? I'm feeling good. I'm a little tired. Um, the reason why I'm tired is because my my baby girl, she's going through this phase where she does not want to sleep at night. 
surprise her head off but what I think it is um, she at first I thought she winged herself off of her pacifier but she actually didn't like it she, she doesn't she can be so she can be picky sometimes basically what I'm trying to say um, and then Thursdays we have no other pacifiers to give her so I was like okay uh, the reason why she's crying tonight is because she wants to pacify her. Um, but I don't have one to give her right now. So I was like, okay, I can just use this time to go ahead and wean her off the pacifier. Or I can just cave in and just buy her a new pacifier. But I was like, okay, we're going to have to wean her off of this anyway. So let me just not give her a pacifier. So, the last few nights, I have been having a few sleepless nights. And I've been very tired. But hey, that's okay because I'm a mother and these are just some sacrifices that we're going to have to make as mothers. Some nights you're going to get some really peaceful sleep and some nights you're not going to get peaceful sleep. And the last few nights soon, I've not been getting a lot of peaceful sleep. But hey, I'm going to keep on pushing, I'm going to keep on enduring because I'm going to see the fruit of my labor and she's going to see the fruit of her labor as well. So yeah. Okay. Something I really, really want. What I really, really want, what I really want right now is a cheeseburger. Really big, juicy burgers with burger with cheese and onions and ketchup and mustard. Oh, from Burger King, that would be awesome. Mm -hmm. My current relationship status, I am married to my husband for four years. Four years. Okay, my favorite movie, okay. My favorite movie actually changes like almost every week because I feel like, because I just love, I love a good storyline. I love movie movies that can ring across their story and their attentions without sexual, without crazy sexual scenes, so many sexual scenes, so much cussing. But, hmm, I can't even say, well, let me just name a few. So, I, my ultimate favorite movie is Princess Diaries 1 and 2. Um, I love The Incredibles. I just love the animation of it. It's just a clean animation of it. And I love all the Avengers um, series, the Thor, Hulk, Captain America, all those different series, all those Marvel's, uh, all those Marvel superhero series, and I love all the DC series as well. It just, oh, so it makes me excited. Okay, so those are just a few of my favorite movies, and I'm telling you, you can ask my husband, so it, it just changes. Because uh, like after I watch a movie, after I, cause I just like a movie that captures my heart and my emotions um, in a good and positive way. Um, I love movies as well, like where it makes you cry, but in the same sense it builds you up. So yeah, if I watch a movie like that, I'm like, oh my gosh, this is, this is my favorite movie now. But yeah. <laughs> so, my favorite song. I really don't have a favorite song. I just have songs for different seasons. And I feel like right now, what I've been listening to right now the most is Brian and Katie Tormolt. They actually released a new a new album. Let me actually see the name of it. They 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 really have they recently released an album called Champion, and that's what I've been listening to. Mainly I've listened to the song Emmanuel Got With Us. So a, a lot of worshipy songs like Bethel, Bethel music, um, Jesus culture, and Natalie. Oh my gosh, you guys need to listen to Natalie Grant's song called Clean. <sighs> it's gonna make you fall out on the floor. Basically, is what I'm trying to say. Such a beautiful, beautiful song. All right, let's move on. My favorite band. I don't have a favorite band. Someone I missed. Oh, okay. I miss my husband right now. My husband has, has been actually been away for almost a month and a half. So I'm super, super duperly missing him. He is truly my best friend. We could talk about everything together. And I love the process that God has brought us to because we've come a long way. Um, my marriage has not been perfect, but we really come a long way. And I just love him so much. And I can just really see how God has really dealt with both of our hearts, even in his time, even in his time when he's been away. Um, 
But yeah, super excited to be reunited, to be reunited with him again. See, my favorite holiday, my favorite holiday is Christmas. And <laughs> everybody who loves Christmas knows exactly why I love Christmas too. It's such a beautiful, such a beautiful season. I just feel like, I feel like majority of people, not everybody, but I feel like majority of people are just so kind. And it's just the atmosphere, it's just so like joyful and just, it's just beautiful. I just think Christmas time is just so beautiful. My favorite animal, my favorite animal is a dog. I love dogs, dogs are so cute. An embarrassing moment, an embarrassing moment. An embarrassing moment. Mm. Mm. I'm trying to think of a recent one. Because I, I have a lot of embarrassing moments. Because there's so many times I'm like, hey, why did you say that? Why did you do that? Like, don't you guys have those moments like, moments like, like, wow, like, why did I say that? Yeah, I have a lot of those moments. But an embarrassing moment when I was actually in middle school, um, when, uh, one day I came to school with some white pants on. And for some reason, I don't know why, Maybe, maybe, maybe there was a, a crowd of people and I was trying to get by. But basically, long story short, I was walking and I fell into a really huge pot, uh, plant pot, and I got brown dirt all over my white pants. And all I remember is me getting up and running to the bathroom and crying. And I just felt so embarrassed. I don't, I don't even remember what happened at that point. I probably, you know what? what I probably did. I probably put. I probably. Tied, I probably um, tied, a, tied a sweater um, around my waist to cover up that dirty spot. But hey, yeah, that was super embarrassing. Where do I work? I currently do not have a job at the moment. Um, I actually am a stay-at-home mom and I'm doing YouTube part-time. So yeah, that's what I'm doing for summer work. Um, something that's constantly on my mind. My husband is constantly on my mind. Um, another thing that's constantly on my mind is like, um, definitely, definitely, I want to be better in every aspect of my life. Um, I want to strive to be better, to be a better mother, a better wife, a better sister, a better daughter, a better worshiper. Like, I just want to be just better. I guess just better all around, all around. And I think that's something that's constantly um, on my mind. And. Um, I'm learning, I'm learning to be content in the state that I am. I guess I just, I always just want more of something. And with that sometimes can come a lot of, um, a lot of uncontentment. A lot of like, maybe I should do that better, maybe I should do that more. But God is just wanting me just to sit back and relax and just keep doing what I'm doing. You know what I mean? Uh, until he corrects me if I'm doing anything wrong. But yeah, so just, I guess just constantly on my mind is wanting to be better, which is not a bad thing. Um, just just sometimes I can allow that thought to get so overwhelming. But I am learning, I'm walking this thing out to learn to be content in everything. I'm content in my current situation. So yeah, all right. My future goals, my future goals is that I want to be able to buy a house. I want to be able to buy my dream car. My dream car is a Beetle or a Bud. I can put a picture right here. It's my dream car. It would be so awesome if it was a convertible Beetle too. That's my dream car. So they hopefully have one or, one or two more kids. I'm still praying about that. I need the Lord to continue to prepare my heart and my mind and my body for that. Um, so yeah, so hopefully two or three more kids. Um, I'm hoping that for the future that I'll have a whole bunch of a whole bunch of subscribers. I'm hoping I'll have a whole bunch of followers on YouTube. That would be so awesome. That would be so awesome. My favorite food. My favorite food is rice. Rice with sugar. And you, you should comment down below if you, if you put um, rice, um, if you sugar, salt, or butter 
or if you combine all three of those together, you should let me know in the comments down below what type of topping do you use for your rice. I use actually, I use sugar. So my favorite foods are rice with sugar. I love pancakes. Um, I basically, honestly, I just love a really good meal. Like I love a really good meal. If you can cook me a really good meal, honey. Ooh, we're gonna be best friends forever. I just like a really good meal. But basically, those two are just my favorite, like favorite foods. Yeah, yeah. I just, I, I, I really like a really good, I really like good food. So, <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah. My ideal of a perfect day. My ideal for a perfect day, and I will always tell my husband is that he doesn't have to spend much on me. Um, like I just basically I basically just want to feel um, feel like feel like I'm his priority and we can go to McDonald's raise some canes go and sit in the car and or go on a picnic or whatever like just you know what I mean just as long as just as long as we're both not distracted to me that's a perfect day you know what I mean where where we both are pursuing each other and loving on each other um, to me, that's a perfect day. Okay, my celebrity crush. A celebrity crush is <laughs> a smiling because I, I know my husband's probably smiling right now. But actually, I, I don't have I don't have a celebrity crush at the moment. Um, I did have one when I was younger. Um, it was actually Usher. Usher was my celebrity crush. I just had a crush on him. I just because I I think because I thought he was really cute and because I really loved his music at the time. Um, but now, I, this is my crush right now and forever. It's my husband. It's my boo. I love you, baby. <laughs> my favorite blog, blog, not vlog, blog. My favorite blog right now is Pastor Stephanie Harrison. Um, she she released a new unbecoming um, series or unbecoming movement, and oh my gosh, it has changed my life forever. Let me actually. I, I want to read to you. What, what basically the basis of the, unbecoming, of the unbecoming movement and the basis of her blog. Um, basically, and it's so beautiful and so powerful to me. I am unbecoming who I've been told to be, thought I was, been labeled as, and even allowed myself to morph into. Maybe the journey isn't about becoming something, but, but about unbecoming everything that isn't really me so that I can be who I was meant to be in the first place. And I think that is so beautiful and I just feel like um, since since I've been connected to her, there's so many things in my life has changed and so many things that God is walking me through and so many things I realized like, man, I need to work on that. And I really need to let that go. I really need to begin to walk in new new things and stuff like that so yeah i'm gonna have that comment down below and i know it's gonna bless your heart because it's been blessing my heart and i hope and pray that you learn and grab hold of something while you're there okay the last question is do i smoke or do i drink no i do not no 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 not putting those things in my temple and in my body no 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 i don't do those things so yeah anyway <laughs> I kind of felt like this was a really long one, but, but yeah. So if you guys have any any, any further questions for me, um, please leave it down below. And if I get enough, um, I will do a separate video regarding those questions. Um, if not, if, if, if there's just a few, I will go ahead and comment. I will go ahead and respond to those um, in the comments down below. But yes, if you have any further questions for me, anything you would like to know about me, um, please leave it down below and I will do my best to answer and respond. So I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out with me for, and I hope you've learned a little bit more about me and I hope this was a little bit enjoying for you and I hope you guys have a really, really great day. I'm saying hope a lot, you know, but you know, yes, I hope you guys have a really great day. Remember to click that thumbs up button and subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye.